Wisdom, the final frontier to true knowledge. Welcome to Wisdom Trek, where our mission is to create a legacy of wisdom, to seek out discernment and insights, to boldly grow where few have chosen to grow before. Hello, my friend. I am Guthrie Chamberlain, your captain on our journey to increase wisdom and create a living legacy. Thank you for joining us today as we explore wisdom on our second millennium of podcast. This is day 1012 of our trek and time for our three-minute mini trek called Humor Unplugged. Our Thursday podcast will provide you with a clean and short funny story to help you to lighten up and live a rich and satisfying life. Something to cheer you and provide a bit of levity to your life. We are told in Proverbs chapter 15 verse 30, A cheerful look brings joy to the heart. Good news makes for good health. We are also encouraged in Proverbs chapter 17 verse 22. A cheerful heart is good medicine, but a broken spirit saps a person's strength. Consider this your vitamin supplement of cheer for today. So let's jump right in with today's funny, which is titled, Get in the Car. Wayne was returning home from a business trip, bags in hand, and slowly making his way to his vehicle in a very crowded airport garage. Suddenly, a dark car screeched to a stop in front of Wayne, and the driver pointed menacingly at him and shouted, Get in! I'll take you to your car! Startled and a bit afraid, Wayne took a step backwards. Uh, uh, no thanks, Wayne answered. I can get there myself. No, the driver barked back as he threw open the passenger side door. Get in! Wayne's eyes now darted around the garage, hoping to find a security guard. Just then, the driver's face and softened. Please, he said. I've been driving up and down this parking lot for two hours. I can't find a space to park. I want yours. Well, I hope that brought a smile to your face today. Our Thursday thought for today is taken from 2 Timothy chapter 4, verse 5. But you should be clear in your mind in every situation. Don't be afraid of suffering for the Lord. Work at telling others the good news and fully carry out the ministry God has given to you. Just as you enjoy these nuggets of humor, please encourage your family and friends to join us and then come along with us tomorrow for another day of Wisdom Trek, Creating a Legacy. If you'd like to listen to any of the past 1,011 treks or read the Wisdom Journals, they are all available at wisdom-trek.com. And I encourage you to subscribe to Wisdom Trek on your favorite podcast player so that each day will be downloaded to you automatically. And thank you so much for allowing me to be your guide your mentor, but most importantly, I am your friend as I serve you through the Wisdom Trek podcast and journal each day. And as we take this trek of life together, let us always live abundantly, love unconditionally, listen intentionally, learn continuously, lend to others generously, lead with integrity, and then leave a living legacy each day. I am Guthrie Chamberlain reminding you to keep moving forward, enjoy your journey, and then create a great day every day. See you tomorrow for Philosophy Friday.